What's up, everybody? This is Dual Zero Humor. Absolutely no laughs will be had this entire game. Um, on the left, we have um, an Egyptian god named Mario Santana Esquivez. On the right, we have um, Franklin, little doo doo dee 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 dee. It's me, Mario! <laughs> nah, Franklin's on the right, Travis right, is on oh, the yeah, left. We got cool Striker Trains. Let's do this. All right, guys. <laughs> Let's see. I drew a bunch of spell cards. I am running a striker deck. You activated the field spell. Oh, hell yeah. Final battle, guys. Let me search out any subterra monster. Oh, any card. Subterra card. It's not final it. battle. Yeah. It's not. That's final. the hidden city. Oh, shit. I know your <laughs> deck better than you. <laughs> well. Uh oh. Here, here comes, comes the, the combo. Here comes here comes the comment section getting angry. <laughs> nah, this is the combo, man. Oh, you set man. the guru, flip the oh, guru, search with guru. Pass. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I'm actually getting the final battle this time, guys. Uh, with the effect of guru, I put him face down and then I activated Hidden City's effect to flip him and get the get the final battle, which, you know, guru lets me search out any sub terror card, so. I, I must have had the Phoenix already in hand, so just search out the final battle, set three, and I gave it up to Travis for All his right. return one. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Um, do you ever get sick of saying guru? Like not, not really, man. You say it like often enough and it might lose its meaning. Guru, 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 guru. Alright, let's see. What am I gonna do first? Um activate the field spell, okay. which allows me to pitch a card and search for a level ten train for my deck. What am I going to pitch? I believe I Ooh. pitched Hornet drones? And immediately after you pitched Hornet drones, I activated Ghost Dogen. Is that what I pitched? I'm not yeah, sure. Yeah, it was sure. Hornet drones. I think so. It was Hornet drones. And you, okay. Ooh, so, five designs. He already knows. <laughs> He's gonna um, get Phoenix out of that three, one. But four, five, six, it's six, fucking Pot of Desires. It's like such a good card. This uh, this deck has a lot of baits. Um, mm -hmm. I'm actually a master baiter yeah. when it comes to this deck. A lot, um, almost all of his cards are like required baits, so it's yeah. like, like a required, you have to negate it. You have to negate the master baiter. Mm -hmm. um, if you don't stop the master baiter before he activates a card that's going to give him pluses, um, he's going to get a lot of things covered all over the field, like these two cards. Because the baits have worked. That was four bait cards in a row. Yeah. And I used up two hand traps right off the bat, right there. Check on so. my banish pile, which there are a bunch of things I can banish in this deck that three suck. three spells in, in uh, Grave, so keep that in mind, because uh, he does run a lot of Sky Striker cards in this deck, hence the name Sky Striker Trains. <laughs> Here we go but, with the ooh, Super Bullet God. Express Train, which specials from more hand. Like, more like Super Cancer Train. <laughs> uh, it is great. Run like, three. Fucking good, yeah. Run four, actually. If you have a fourth copy, put a fourth one in your deck. Mm -hmm. And then don't before the duel, cut. put it on top of your deck and don't let your opponent cut. <laughs> That way you, oh, you always draw it. And he links some into... Make uh, sure you have pocket trains. Like, keep trains in your pocket. Pocket trains. That would be a pretty hard to, to get through an airport Ooh. like that. Okay. So, used uh, the effect to chain. Summon that. I'm going to go for a rank 10 play here. Trying to bait Super out long. some back row. I've already baited the hand traps, but none of the back row has been had. So... I have no choice but to try and pop my own face-up card with the afterburners because I know the final battle is back there. I gotta hit the final battle to be over. So we're gonna chain. I'm gonna make him invincible. Oh no, but I, I chained infinite permanents, mm -hmm. so it really fucks up his whole game plan. At so that I believe Dora. I do get to pop both of your back row cards. Hmm. Um, so he gets one. Oh, didn't have misplay. I did not resolve yes. uh, the striker card. Yeah. Well, now, well, so it happens. Um, hmm. but it was a big misplay at that point because I got the final battle. I got a free search. Always remember when you activate any card yes. in a striker variant deck. Always look at your grave before and after you activate cards. I'm telling you, I've made mistakes like that so frequently. And when you're in high profile events, making mistakes like this obviously it cost you. could cost you like it just did. So, checking the grave. Um, 
really considering what I'm going to do with the next couple years of my life. I might get back in contact with my family, you know, resolve my parental issues. Um, maybe go to therapy, start to run. At this point, I'm shuffling uh, my cards, trying to make it hard for Travis to notice that I'm actually scratching my balls. So. Yeah, he can actually do that with uh, the vagina he also has. Oh, man. I mean, I'm multitasking, <laughs> you know? Sometimes I stick both of them in. Ooh, the <laughs> duality oh, for the, the dual duality. humor. Hell yeah. Oh. And he just resolved. I picked up Oof. the... There can only be one, and at that point, what can trains do at that point? It's well, tough. I would have been able to have summoned the other one from the grave, but... I'm not entirely sure. If I had popped a card, what do you think I should have popped? Your final battle or your field spell? Uh, final battle would be better. I, I either think way, it's I would have gotten the advantage. Um, it still would have searched. The next turn, in the next turn, but yeah. um, like, like. And if I put harder. anything on board, you can turn it face down. Mm -hmm. I might have been able to survive one more turn, but oh. you know. Okay, so we're in game two, guys. Um, starting off the same way I started off with game one, Hidden City. Wow. Searching out Guru. At this point, they're gonna. Be, I know there's someone in the comment section gonna be like, "Yo, this guy stacked his deck." <laughs> Dude, always have the pocket hidden exactly, cities. That's why man. it's called hidden city. You don't see all those rip uh, stuff on my shirt. That's where I leave all my hidden cities in there. Yeah, each of those is a pocket with a different exactly. subterror card in them. So, um, right by his nipples are extra gurus, mm -hmm. and then uh, the fiendess is close. is all the way at the bottom uh. of the shirt. Um, oh, getting the final battle. I think that is the first card you search with Guru. Um, really, really great. I would choose it over Fiendus. Mm, that's a tough decision right there. It's, like, it's a very situational. I would say, depending on who you're facing and what deck you're facing. Well, in your you opponent's draw phase, opponent's you face. can activate the final battle, flip mm -hmm. the Guru, search the Fiendus, and then now you have an active Fiendus before your opponent's main phase. So, I think that that's pretty smart. He adds that there can only be one, and there can only be one friend in your life. So, right now, I'm considering cutting Franklin Al out. Although, we did side for game two. And yes. Look at what he has. I got the First reboot card. in hand. For me, I hate Red Oof. Reboot with a passion. Ooh. I only wish I draw that, the that TCG could do the same thing and put it at two here. So, <laughs> it's not bad. <laughs> uh, it's a great card, but I think if they're going to give so many great back row cards support, they should definitely give waste out. And Travis contemplating on to end their friendship, and he does. So with, there we like, go. Jizikiru, the Jizz monster. Jizikiru right? taking out Guru. First time I've seen that happen to me game, like, turn one. Ooh, it's the rare. twin, and I pitch my field spell. I think that's also a mistake on my part. Um, I think that that might have been a bad idea. And the baits! Oof. The baits! The oh, pot man. of duality. I mean, so. you know what they say, once you get two master baiters, like, in the same room with each other... The um, room never is the same. It's best not to use a black light in that room. Um, and there can only be one. It's been activated. And the and reboot. The red reboot. So if this resolves, as long as I have the other monster in hand, which I do, that is the full OTK combo. Well, I think this spells uh, demise for Guru. Yes. I at, think this is their final battle. At this point, uh, puns out of the way. <laughs> set the judgment. <laughs> at this point, I'm just playing it out. So I just uh -huh. set my best trap card, which is judgment. And, um, Normal yeah. summon the Pegasus. Snag it. I chained Call by the Grave. But Ooh. something nice and quirky that happens right now is Travis's mm -hmm. awareness in field presence. Yep. Chaining to get the monster anyways. Always summon the Knuckle card. if you can, Knuckle. even if you have the rank 10 already. Basically, by tributing yeah. Knuckle, he could special summon a train from yeah. the grave. You can circumvent so. interruptions. And he's going for Gustav Max. Yep. Take out 2k. And I'm at 6,000 right now. Derek Crane pops Andrew. a card on the field. Oh my god. That's it. I'm trying to take his card out of spite. <laughs> 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 and... He attacks me for 6k, and that's game. I just pick up my cards, and uh, yep. we're moving on to game three. There are so many two-card combinations in trains alone, not even with the striker portion, that result in this combo of getting the max with the pop. And it's really, really easy. You see your field spell, search your Derek Rain. You know, get the urgent schedule, pull out your Derek Rain. You know, you always want to whip out as many trains as you can from your deck. Mm-hmm. 
just uh, another deck that got strengthened uh, with the new master rule. The new master rule is going to make this deck so unprecedented. You could probably, you know, get four uh, Gustav Max effects in one turn. Um, it's very possible in trains um, with some secret tech that we'll oh, show man. you guys in an upcoming profile. So you heard it first, guys. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Trains okay. are a secret FTK deck and definitely an OTK deck, and the new master rule is going to make them one of the stronger contenders. I activated Pot of Extravagance, draw two cards. And while we're at a, mm -hmm. like, stroking our own cock right now. <laughs> stroking um, our egos. Just, uh, we did start a Patreon that oh. if you guys want to... Uh, uh, be patrons there. It'll be awesome giveaways coming up in the near future. You know, uh, any amount so. of money can help yes. save children in need, um, but instead me. give that to us. Yeah. Um, Especially me, man. I I feel like every time I have to play a card that's not max ready, I mm -hmm. I, I die. Oh. A bit so inside, you so. search Fiendus with your field yes. spell. Interesting. Yes. Very at that smart. point, um, I must have the Guru in hand um, at, mo at the worst, and then I'm all three games out. you open with the field spell. Oh, very hmm. interesting. Interesting. <laughs> Check my deck at fifteen. <laughs> <laughs> like no one's getting out of this. We just see your hand. It's nothing but six judgments six. and a Guru. Judgments and a gu Guru. A guru. Oh man, so I searched out Final Battle. Mm -hmm. That's what Travis was talking about. The Final That's Battle great, right man. there. Good set. Have basically full combo for, for Guru at that point. Every other card can yeah. be like any random shit. And Prohibition. At this point, I know I called mm -hmm. Red Reboot because yeah. I was a little salty with the game too. With how <laughs> <laughs> Red Reboot is like really the only card that hurts this deck a lot. I don't think I have one in hand now yeah, that I'm looking at my hands. It's a precautionary measure. Could draw into one. I set five, the classic uh, control Ooh, variant. And I drew a Pegasus. But I do have the Twin Twisters, I can see, and I do have the Urgent Schedule, which I'm going to slap down first, Ooh, trying to get those baits. baits on field. Oof, met with Tikaboo. So this is also a misplay. Um, oh, okay. Twin Twister. Hit the Tikaboo, and uh, let's hit that. Okay. No so reboot, so might as well not hit the Prohibition. And I have to fiend this that uh, to make sure that the Twin doesn't mm -hmm. go resolve and destroy though there can only be one so this is a, a misplay on my part this is before i understood how this card really works its rulings and it's very important for all of you to understand this if you're considering playing trains if you activate urgent schedule while uh Tikaboo is up it does resolve it does summon the monsters out but then you are forced to send so um don't let anybody try to correct you even if you have a monster you can still activate it if the summoning conditions are met you still have to send after that is done so potentially could have grabbed more resource by sending a bullet express and most likely would have had at least a body on field to uh protect me from the big old damage franklin is about to slap down on the table that is true and now i searched out nemesis archer with guru's effect and um i'm gonna show you a nice little damage that uh Subterrors can actually pull This is off. quite a defense to go up against. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I'm just going to summon Nemesis Archer. Let's Make sure cards. uh, those cards still exist. They do. <laughs> Make they sure do. they don't change text. <laughs> uh. one turn, so I'm summoning Archer. I'm going to tackle Guru. And chain the battle? Yeah, do my anime style attack. Yes. And yeah, we lost 5k within that uh, battle. <laughs> <laughs> That's me taking damage. Um, really uh, playing with the ooh, creases on my pants quick now. Effect. Um, there's about six creases on my pants. Um, oh, and there's a duel going on, I think. Um, Franklin's, I think he's playing solitaire. At this point, yeah. I'm kind of, if you look close, I'm jerking off right now. So. And then I'm going to activate Nibiru. Just kidding. No, <laughs> no this can't happen. Um, Guru could never get Nibiru, can it? I don't think so. I think, never I link. One time, there's some guy that had Nibiru in hand. Have you ever linked? I. Have you ever linked once? Maybe, Nibiru? maybe once, like to like some like really mm. bad player in our locals. <laughs> like, I, I think it was playing Deathbox. Shout uh -huh. out to you, buddy. I'm, oh. I'm sorry that you. That, that you had such a rough childhood to play Deathbox. <laughs> uh, they're hypothetically good. Um, 
with a good player. All right, so engage. He activated engage. I activated fiendish. fiendish. And at this point, Travis is like, I don't have enough advantage to do anything. And I had Imperial Order. I lose one turn and infinite. But at that point, anyone would scoop. Got um, the Imperial Order. And I'm showing off the Pro Vision. Mm -hmm. Travis is contemplating if he wants to rip that card and punch me in the face. Um, it is a but viable option. It would it would be very helpful and yeah. Subterra wins. Right. If you guys love this, please check it out.